This is the Emmanuel Family Devotion for Saturday, February the 20th, looking at this weekend's worship by taking a look at the Gospel reading from Mark 1, 19-15. Pause the video, read Mark 1, 19-15. More temptation on this first Sunday in Lent. The Gospel reading, in it Jesus is tempted. Notice again that Mark uses the word immediately twice in the reading. When temptation happens, urgency is always appropriate. There was urgency in what Jesus did in our text. After he was baptized, the text says he went immediately to the wilderness for temptation. For 40 days, he was continually tempted. He was tempted in every way. Every way. Now that thought may make us uncomfortable. And then comforted. Every temptation we endure, Jesus has already endured. He was tempted all the way to the cross and through the horror of the cross. He resisted every temptation and then credited to your account perfect resistance to all temptation. When you are tempted, Jesus comes with urgency to your side, with help and with hope. However, the devil tempts you, and he knows your weaknesses. However you are tempted, Jesus was tempted in the very same way. Hold on to that. His strength and power are right next to you. Hold on to Him. And so when you are tempted with urgency, turn to Jesus. Turn to Jesus where He is found. It is no accident that the words we speak right before the Lord's Supper are found in the Lord's Prayer, lead us not into temptation. At the Lord's table is found forgiveness for all of your giving into temptation and the strength to resist the next time. One of the most troubling things about COVID-19 is that so many Christians have been driven from the Lord's Supper, some for months on end, others for nearly a year. As your pastor, I plead with you with urgency to run to the Lord's Supper. There is where Christ is found, His forgiveness, His love, and His strength are there for you. Please pray with me. Heavenly Father, it is with urgency that you won my salvation. Prompt me to turn to you with urgency. Move me with urgency into your grace-filled presence in the Lord's Supper. In Jesus' name, amen. Again, Emmanuel is worshiping on site and online at Emmanuel. Uh, we are worshiping on Saturday at 6 and Monday at 6. Uh, both of those services are somewhere between 8 and 20% capacity. Uh, and then also on Sunday morning uh, with about uh, a 30% capacity. Uh, in between services, uh, we have uh, sanitation uh, happening uh, by, by sterilizing the pews, uh, by not sharing bulletins. Uh, it is my prayer that uh, with the social distancing and with the mask wearing the entire hour, that soon you feel comfortable uh, in returning to worship. But until then, uh, use these uh, opportunities and devotion and uh, the recording of the service that comes into your home about 10 o'clock each Sunday morning. Until then, uh, we'll see you in church when the time is right. God bless.